it guys. Today I'm going to be trying to make a sissy bar jig. So it won't be the kind of typical jig, like the full, it won't be a jig for the full bar, it'll literally just be one point. I assume you know what I'm talking about, like the big flat bits where they have the uh, metal welt on it so you can bend it round. Um, it won't be a full sissy bar kind of like bed jig, it'll just be one point because I don't really have the space or the resources to make a full bed and also with what I'm envisioning in my head I'm not really sure how a flat bed jig would work because it's a lot more three dimensional than just the flat shape. So from what I've seen of them, they tend to be a metal sheet with a metal welds on it. There might be other different ones but those are the ones I've seen so far so I'm just going to make like a little square sheet with one on it and we'll see if that works. So you might remember this bit of metal back from when Monty was here. Um, yeah, that work we did on the top here has kind of been rendered useless. We're not going to use it. So what I'm going to do is chop off that and use this as the bit to bend the metal around. I think it's kind of like maybe thick enough. I'm going to have the metal and the vise. The the part where I bend it round and then I'll be here bending. That's that's the vision I've got in my head. So I'm thinking that could do it. Uh, I also don't really have any other like circular bits of metal just to hand right now. I mean I could go rifling through the bits and bobs we've got over there but I don't want to use something my dad had a plan for later on or whatever, so we're going to use this one. That's the first thing I've got to do, I've got to cut it off, I've got to cut a metal sheet and weld it on. So let's do that. Um, <laughs> I just realised I've locked myself in by accident. I don't really know how to get out. Like I need to be able to flick the lock from the other side. I must have something slim enough to like the ruler. I'm <laughs> locked in. Aha! Oh yeah. The only person in at the minute is my brother and he's asleep so I would have just been stuck in here being the fucking pee. <laughs> vids for the gram for the gram it's so handy that my dad built that shelf because now I can just pop my phone on it and I don't have to like makeshift a tripod like I know it's super lame I would spend time makeshifting a tripod out of the tools and shit in here or like at least uh, a platform so I could get my phone at the right height so I could record what I was doing. It just took forever, but now I just pop it up there and it works fine, so... Yeah, oh I don't want these, I want my other ones. Oh, that'll do. The 
jig has been made. It is terrible. Uh, but hopefully that will stick on. I'm just going to get some clamps and clamps on. Although, where are the clamps? I don't think you guys can see. So I've kind of had to wedge it in between the two. Honestly, I don't know if this is means that, I mean, I don't know if this is a good idea. It might mean that uh, I bend the tube in ways that I don't want to bend it because it's not like flat. Uh, yeah, I don't really know much about that. <laughs> And my only other problem is, is that's plastic, and if I put heat on that, oh yeah, good point. But I've literally got no other way to...
fuck it. This is cheap because it's not that expensive, so I can live with buying a little bit more. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't understand the diagram, I've just drawn it. I've drawn myself instructions just a second ago and I don't know what they mean. I should cut this down, but I don't know the length I want, so like... This is 100% not going to work. We're gonna give it a go. Second problem. I don't know where the blowtorch is. Where the fuck is it? You shall not pass. Is it in one of those boxes? I feel like they just pressed the button, but I'm scared if I just press the button. Something bad will happen. Let me check my phone. I know how that works. It's just a matter of applying it. Okay, so I need proper heat gloves on this hand. Oh, 
that needs to be held. So maybe if I use my body weight, hold it in place, and yeah. Right. First thing we need to do is heat up. So I was told that the tip of the blue flame is the hot part. I'm kind of worried I can't actually see the flame very well. But yeah, so the tip of the flame is the really hot part and I want to wait until it gets like red hot. I just feel I'm going to burn myself somehow, I just know it. Burned myself the other day doing something stupid. Oh, it's changing colour already. It's gone purple. Blue. Ah, ah, ah. Scary. Scary. It's gone back to like a white colour. Now. Oh lord, I'm so fucking terrified. This is scary, this is scary, this is scary. Get in there. Faster, faster, faster. Bend it, and bend it. I'm not bending it. Okay, 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 okay. Hold that still. Turn that off. This is very dangerous. And it doesn't look like I'm able to bend it. Unfortunately. This is so fucking annoying. It's not you getting, oh, if it's the fucking dustpan over there getting in my way. I need to be way more careful, bro. I need to put that right on my fucking leg. think of it's if I hold one end and bend it around the vise. Okay, attempt number one was a duty. Now I shall try for attempt number two. Mm -hmm. No problem is I've made this so that it won't actually fit in the vise very well. Dicks! kidding me why am I like this oh wait I'm so stupid I can just do it this way this might actually help me from bending it the way I don't want to bend it too well if I pop it in there so I'm thinking maybe like this well, I just don't think I just don't think it's gonna work like I haven't got the strength oh fuck it we'll try I think I'll try and heat it up for longer as well. The, the colour definitely changed, but maybe not as much as it should have done. I don't know. Again, I can't see the flame very well, but... Does that mean it's running out, maybe? I don't know. So yeah, sorry I haven't like been around that much. Um, you know, it's summertime now in the UK and everything's opening up, so everything that I couldn't really do last year, I'm trying to get it all done now. So I've been going roller skating with my friends, I've gone paddle boarding, I've been going to the pub, you know, I've gone to the beach, all this kind of stuff that I couldn't really do last year. Trying to make sure I'm like getting it all done. So that's why I haven't really been around as much in here. I've also been waiting for parts still, so uh, I've just.
just commissioned someone to do my handlebars. I was going to do my handlebars myself, but I realized uh, it's just something I'm not capable of doing. And it is better off I get someone else to do it. Um, and with the whole like experiencing each thing I can do, I can just say, well, I tried to make this, which is kind of like a similar concept, like bending the metal and stuff, like metal tubes. So it's not quite the same because the guy who will be doing the handlebars is doing it with dies. But um, yeah, like at least I've tried and if this doesn't work out very well, like I guess maybe I can try and commission someone to make it. Um, but this is quite complicated, I don't know if anyone would want to because it's just like a fucking ball leg and also be very very expensive for me. Um, but yeah, I'm going to give it a go, I'm going to give the handlebars to somebody else. Uh, still waiting on my tank to come back, but to be fair, like when the tank comes back all I really need to do is like paint it. Yeah. Paint it, uh, get a new fuel tap so there's even more parts to wait for. So, but I really don't like the fact that I can't see the flame when I turn it off. I know most people just leave it on the side, but I literally can't see the flame. I feel like that might be hot enough now. I'm gonna turn this off. Okay, I'm gonna turn this off. <laughs> and then, shit, 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 shit. I don't know if that's... There's no way I'm strong enough to bend that. Fuck. Wah! <laughs> I've now just got a really hot bit of metal. Um... I just melt... I just did all that just to do nothing. Okay. Let's put that in between my feet. I can't do anything. If I let go of this, it's going to hurt. If I let go of that. I'm running out of ideas, friends. I'm running out of ideas. Pop that there. point but I don't have a leverage point I'm not smart enough to know what to do next uh, back to the thinking board I don't know where to put this because it's still hot obviously yeah it needs to cool down somewhere. I guess maybe if I just leave it in the vise, it won't go anywhere. Okay, well that was a fucking duty. Uh, <laughs> oh shit, I was gonna say I'll come back another day and see if I can continue this, but I just realised I won't be able to because I won't be here on the weekend. So this is the end of this week's video. How pointless. <laughs> but as always, until then, take it easy. If it's pissing you off that this is taking a while, like, I totally agree with you. You know what you could do? You could maybe, like, um, I don't know, go on my Patreon and kind of give me some money so I can build this thing faster. You know, like, it would be nice. I'm joking. Anyways, but yeah, uh, I've got a Patreon if you want to check that out. I know I've got a few new people hanging about, so I don't know if they knew that. And, um, nah. Yeah. <laughs> Look more into this, because apparently I didn't really don't really know what I'm doing. Maybe the tube's too thick. Maybe the setup isn't right. Maybe I'm just not strong enough. That is a possibility. I'm just not strong enough to bend it even if it's hot. 
maybe it wasn't hot enough, maybe I need to do it faster, maybe this isn't right, maybe I need a different thing. Who knows? There is an endless list of reasons why I didn't do so great with this. More gas. Have I not shut this properly or something? I'm scared, I'm scared. I just don't want anything blowing up like last time. Dragging this on, I'm blubbity da ba da I'll try and be back next week uh, with this or the tank or something. And if I'm not back next week, then you know it's because I've got nothing. Yeah, so feel free to leave a thumbs down, tell me you're an idiot and how I should have been doing this in the comments if you so wish. Uh, until then, have a good weekend. Bro, hot.